it's Mina. Welcome back to my channel or if this is the very first video that you're seeing of me then welcome to my channel. Please be sure to hit the subscribe button down below if you didn't already. I post every day of the week for a while and today in this video I'm going to talk about my top five party pet peeves. Now you know when you throw a party sometimes you have some things that bother you when it comes to parties and stuff like guests not respecting the guest of honor for the party or one guest trying to make other people miserable and stuff i'm sure some of you guys may have gone through that when it came to like either your kids parties or your parties so i'm gonna get started and if your party pet peeves are the same thing as same as mine mine that's fine that's interesting or if you have different party pet peeves what are they let me know down in the comments below because maybe they're similar to mine maybe they're different to mine but i'm gonna get started so number one on my list would have to be one guest trying to make everyone else miserable because they're not having a good time this has happened to me about me at several parties that i've gone to like i remember like one time i went to a few of my friends birthday parties and we have this one friend who was not very nice to us like she just tried to make everyone else miserable because she was not having a good time because she she was just mad and stuff stuff and she just wanted to make everyone else miserable and she just chose to sit and cry and then just be mean to everybody buddy that was one of my thing that really drives me crazy about parties is like when one guest tries to make one person miserable because they're not having a good time like this has happened to me several times several times at a few parties like because when a couple people have like either cried or was chose to be mean to the uh, to every one of the guests just because they were not having fun fun and that really drives me crazy one thing about going to a party is you need to be rural about going to a party is you need to be respectful of the guest of honor and the guests around you and just to have a good time and enjoy Enjoy spending time with them. You don't want to go around making everybody else miserable because that's going to want to make people not invite you to their parties. Number two on my list had to be some guests being inconsiderate for another guest. Yes, now this has happened um, to me once when I went to one of my friends' sleepover birthdays a couple years ago. This was like back when I was a freshman in high school. I was at one of my friends' sleepover birthdays and... Um, I needed to sleep on the couch because I can't sleep with my knee on the floor because it feels uncomfortable because it's still been very numb. It's been very numb since I had the surgery. I don't feel anything when I touch my right knee. I know that's kind of weird. Weird is, is because there's metal in there. I can't feel anybody touching it. And it doesn't feel comfortable when I sleep on the floor. So I had to sleep on the couch, but these girls wouldn't move and we were trying to get them to move so I could sleep on the couch because I couldn't sleep on the floor and stuff and my friend wasn't very happy about that and she was trying to be very considerate for me and she was trying to get the other guests to get off the couch so I could sleep but the guest was refusing and so it took a while but they ended up being considerate and they got off the couch so I could sleep on the couch. Number three on my list would have to be people not respecting the guest of honor. This has happened to happened at a several parties that I've gone to. I've been to a party where one guest refused to do what the guest of honor wanted to do, or they wanted to just shun themselves out of it and be miserable because the guest of honor wanted to do something that they didn't want to do, and they need to understand that it's that guest of honor's day, and they want to make it extra special for that person person and that really drives me crazy because you need to be nice to the guest of honor because they're inviting you to a party and you need to respect what they want to do do it's not about that about you it's about the guest of honor number four in my list would have to be someone not following the party rules now this was one of um, one of my pet peeves oh sorry i had um just a notification on my tablet anyway so um this is one of my biggest pet peeves is people like not following the party rules, like them like not being respectful, respectful, going around and messing with other people's things or teasing or this or that. It's just not not respectful. I really hate that. That really bothers me when people don't follow the rules or like they'll go into someone's room when they're not supposed to or they don't tell other people where they're going. It drives me crazy, crazy and they just leave the party. Number five on my list would have to be people playing harsh pranks on other people. Now, this has happened 
one time when I was um, having a sleepover with my friends, this was when I was a sophomore in high school, I invited all my friends to sleep over and we were all sleeping in the living room. And one of my, and my sister was sleeping on the couch because she fell asleep there. And one of my friends needed to sleep on the couch because she had back problems because she couldn't sleep on the floor because she had back surgery a couple years ago and it was hard for her to sleep on the floor. So what she did was she grabbed some she, my other friend was trying to tickle my sister to get her to wake up, but um, tickle my sister to get her to wake up, and um, it didn't work. So then one of my friends is not thinking, picks up a water bottle and pours it on my sister's head. My sister runs into my mom's room crying, and my mom is not very happy about that. That, that's not really okay. People should not be playing harsh pranks at sleepovers because it makes that person not want to go to the sleepover, or in case my sister or in this case, my sister, it made her probably, her, it made her feel uncomfortable with that person coming over because my friend um, spilled water on her head and made her cry. And it's like really harsh. Harsh. And I've noted, and there are some pranks that, harsh pranks people will pull at sleepovers. Like some will shave eyebrows or they'll stick whipped cream in your, cream in your hand and then tickle your nose and so you can put it all over your nose. No, I haven't had that prank actually happen, but I've seen it on TV happen at slumber parties, so I don't know if that prank actually happens. Happens and stuff, but if that's harsh, like people pouring water in people, that's really harsh. And good thing it's not soda or else that would have been really sticky. Sticky, yeah. My mom, when that happened, was not very happy with my friend when she did that to my sister. That was really harsh. Okay, so those are my top five party pet peeves. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Thank you so much for watching. Please be sure to like and subscribe if you didn't already. I post every day of the week for all, and I'll see you in another video soon. Bye!